today we are going to review Tenny's YouTube channel. Tenny, uh, her channel is about learning uh, Korean and we're gonna check her channel and see uh, how we can give her some tips and tricks in order for uh, the algorithm to pick up her channel and she can grow it. And so um, first of all, before we proceed, guys, I want to introduce myself quickly for you. If this is the first time you see me, my name is Saman. I'm from Egypt. I'm a YouTube expert. I've been in the field for more than four years. However, I was behind the cameras most of the time. I worked in, on more than 400 YouTube channels and some exceeded the 10 million subscribers and optimized more than 10,000 videos on the platform. And I'm a content creator myself here on this YouTube channel. So feel free to subscribe to my channel if you want to know how to grow your YouTube channel and take it to the next level and turn it into a money making machine. So right now we will start with reviewing uh, Tenny's YouTube channel. So the first thing here, as I can see, is her YouTube channel banner, which is a good one. Uh, however, we need some modifications, Tenny, here, and let me explain what we need to do. So your channel banner is the first thing that people notice when they open your channel and see it after they probably watch one of your videos so they get curious and they open your youtube channel to see exactly what this channel is about and think if this is going to be suitable for them to subscribe or not so at this stage at your uh with the current subscribers uh number that you have which is 100 subscribers our aim our first goal here is to hit the 1000 subscribers and the 4k watch hour this is the first thing we need to do so we will try as possible as we can to get people to subscribe and watch our videos within our when we uh when we like put the videos out there or in the channel banner and so on and this is what we call it's a call to action call to action means is that we ask the audience to do something for us so uh my advice here in your channel is first of all to try to change the white background that you have because um youtube does have uh the dark mode and the light mode the dark mode which is in black as the as you can see here on my screen and the light mode is when you have the white background of youtube so if your channel better is just a plain white like this it's gonna blend out with the website and it's not gonna stand out and we want something that really creates um a kind of contrast so people can see the channel banner really really clearly even if they have the white or the dark mode so my advice is to change the white background that you have here use something like yellow turquoise purple any kind of color and you do have something like canva they do have uh free templates that you can use it so consider uh, consider doing this the second thing i really love like what you are saying here, keeping you motivated while learning Korean. It's amazing that you are telling exactly what people will be expecting when they come to your channel. So I really love this. The, uh, the last thing you need to do here, which is to ask people to subscribe, add, the, add a call to action, asking them to subscribe. And let me show you here how I'm doing this on my own YouTube channel myself. Since I'm starting and I have like even a less number of subscribers than you do have on your own YouTube channel. So this is my channel banner and as i can see i'm also putting my portrait here and this is one of the things i wish you would be able to do it to put a photo for yourself because it connects with the audience more and they would see like this is someone that i would be happy to see and talk with and so on and especially that faces really attracts the audience attention at all instead of the text okay and i'm adding here like also that we call this it's like um uh, a statement that tells people exactly what they would be expecting when they come and visit your channel we call this a unique selling point what's your unique selling point what is the thing that i'm gonna i'm gonna benefit when i'm subscribing to your channel i teach lots of things here on my youtube channel regarding youtube like how to grow a youtube channel how to get views how to monetize and so on however the thing that i want people to remember me with is that i help them turn their youtube channel into a money making machine this is what makes me different from all the youtube channels out there that are talking about growing a youtube channel okay so here you are doing it in a great way that you're saying you're keeping you motivated while learning korean so i really love uh the uh the statement that you chose and as you can see here i can clearly i'm putting here clearly a call to action which is i'm asking people to subscribe to my channel so my advice is to do this here 
on your channel banner and guys i'm gonna do a youtube tutorial about a youtube channel banner and how you can make something like this one that i'm doing here that i made on my own youtube channel i made it totally and completely for free i'm gonna leave a link for the video once i have it done in the description uh, box below so make sure to check it and see if this is something that you want to learn the step by step and the psychology behind it then you can go ahead and check the description box uh, if I have the video in the links that means that I published it and then you can go and check the tutorial the step-by-step -step how I created the uh, YouTube channel better now after the YouTube channel better comes the about section which is actually completes the YouTube channel banner and the about section is part of the SEO and when we talk about SEO then we mean is that we make the channel or the video or the playlist uh, available or uh, better for the algorithm to recognize it and get it into the search results the first page search results and what I mean by this is that for example here I search I was actually searching for some uh, stuff related related to your channel here like Korean basic grammar as an English speaker and those are the videos that came up for me those videos came up for me okay because those videos have the best seo okay along with other factors of course but this is one of the things so uh the about section is one of the parts where we use this technique the seo when we talk about the seo one of the main things about it is the keywords and let me explain this to you so you'll be able to understand youtube is a search engine optimized is a search engine which means that people come on the platform because they want to search for some information that they want to learn about okay like how like what i did here like i came and searched for this phrase so this phrase here this is we name this a search query okay so what you need to do or some people actually they name it a keyword okay so what you need to do in your about section is you make sure that you have keywords that people are searching for and make paragraphs here about it and in order for you to find those keywords you have to use a keyword an seo tool like vidiq or tubebuddy and i recommend vidiq to be honest i i love this uh i love this uh app uh, or this plugin and it really helps me a lot so i suggest that you just even buy the paid version for just one month find all the keywords related to your niche and then start using them the free version it gives you results but it's not as the paid one the paid one is really 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 good and i usually don't actually uh, advise my clients to invest a lot uh, when they are starting out and pay a lot of money except for just two things a good mic and the vid iq tool at least for one month so uh, let's start here for for example i want to show you how i use the tool korean language for beginners for example well, i do have terrible spelling mistakes <laughs> okay so as you can see here i want to explain quickly how the tool works so you'll be able to understand how you can use it so this is the search volume this means that how many people are searching for this certain keyword on youtube as you can see those here they are just the three thousand people which is a very very ser low search uh volume here there are nearly a uh, quarter a million of searches which is a good thing okay however here the competition means like how many videos are out there talking about this topic so we want as much as we can to find low competition it means that there are lots of people are searching for this uh, keyword however there are not lots of videos covering this topic there is a higher demand than the uh than the videos that are out there when we have a very high competition that means it's going to be harder for you to rank so the actually the uh, the paid version shows you all the results that you can find about this so that's why i really suggest that you go ahead and you buy the paid version at least just for one month and gather all the keywords that you need in order to uh, make videos around it use it in your description your titles your tags and so on so uh, this is actually when it comes to the uh, description here you make sure that you have that it has actually uh keywords that people are searching for 